Alright, so this is a video for 9002 Tudor, uh, Unit 101. This is the building itself, and I'm going to give you a little panoramic view of the, the neighborhood. This complex, I'd say it probably has a dozen buildings like this. This is, uh, there's actually water on the, at the other end of this. On this side is water, and over here you can see the busy road. But uh, you can actually take a left and it goes back towards the entrance. So this is kind of the, the last uh, building in this subdivision. So you have this little, uh, I don't know, interior walkway between these three buildings. And 101 is in here. I already opened up the door and just took a quick peek inside. So I'll show you. So 101 is right here when you walk in. Um, you can see the mailbox and then uh, some other units. So this one right now, they do not have the power on, but there's enough natural light that you can still see it pretty well. I will say that this house or this, this building has a little bit of a smell to it. It's hard to kind of pinpoint it whether it's a mildew or just has a little bit of an odor. So I'm not sure if that's something that could easily be freshened up. I know you can't tell in the video. This actually, as you, as you know, photographs really well. And actually it's, it, obviously the video shows what it is. Um, like I said, there's no power, so I can't turn on any lights, but you can see the kitchen and everything pretty well. So down the hallway, you do have a little uh, pantry area. Laminate floors. Also, um, of course, it has the ceiling fans and does have the popcorn ceiling. I also want to pay attention to uh, road noise. It's really not too bad. Really not bad at all, but um, there is a little bit of noise. So in here is your AC and your hot water heater. Um, your laundry actually is right here. You can see the stackable, um, or the, the, the dryer vent. So this is all in one room. So you have, uh, one of your bathrooms here. And then here at the end of the hall, we have two more bedrooms. Like I said, I can hear the road noise in here. Everyone has a personal preference. It starts to become a white noise, but yeah, you, know, you do hear you do hear it from outside. So this is your master, being that it has a private bathroom. So very very updated. Like I said, I I can see how the photographs look. Absolutely amazing. Um, and it is what it is. I mean, it looks like a good clean unit. I mean, it seems like a heck of a price at the price that they're asking. Um, I have to look at the comps. But, you know, the neighborhood itself is so so. I mean, it is what it is. It's you know, not a super expensive community. Um, I don't know crime in this area. I'll just tell you honestly, you can research it online. Um, so I don't know if there's any issues as far as that goes. The other person in this video is my assistant, uh, Kelly. So she joined me in case you see another person in the video. So this is uh, basically the whole unit. Um, the Because this is a condo, the HOA takes care of your uh, roof and your exterior and your yard and all that, you would be responsible for the appliances, the plumbing, the air conditioning. So if you like what you see, um, I can check into the air conditioning, see if I can find out the year of it. These, these appliances look brand, yeah, they're brand new. Remove film before using. So those are all brand new appliances. So that's nice. Yeah, all brand new. So, nice color choices.
good, good open space. And it's, it's nice. I do see a little bit of dirt from the air, from the air, the air vent. Goes out the ceiling fan. All right, that completes my video for Twitter.